Hello, my name is Mike Rainer and I'm with eWrench.com. This demonstration about installing and running portable applications on a USB drive. Frequently in primary and secondary education, teachers are not allowed to install software on the computers that their students use. This is a demonstration of how to overcome that by running certain software or portable applications from a USB drive. So what is a portable app? Portable apps is a way of running Windows software programs off a USB drive without installing anything or making any changes to the underlying computer. So let's take a look at the portalapps.com page. Uh, right here where you can download it. Let's go take a look at different apps that this shows. Well, we've got Firefox. These are accessibility here. We've got some development apps got education, some education apps, games, you may not want to use those for your students, the graphics and pictures, uh, one of the graphics GIMP which is uh, comparable to um, Photoshop, photo and image editor is uh, open source and free that you can put on there, internet, of course you've got your browsers, uh, Firefox and the other stuff music and video here is VLC media player portable and that's one item that we're going to install and uh, along with the portal apps just to simply show how how it works and then for office uh, office Lib Libre office portable just came out so that's another one that came out so all in all you've got about 200 apps here uh, if you want a more solid definition of what a portable app is we can go right here according to their definition, a portable app definition is a computer program that you can carry around with you on a portable device and use on any Windows computer when your USB flash drive, portable hard drive, iPod or other portable device is plugged in. You have access to your software and personal data just as you would in your own PC. And when you unplug the device, none of your personal data is left behind. Uh, so that's their definition. and. I go into it in a little more detail there. You can take a look at that, but uh, I'm going to go through here. I'm going to end this right here and continue with the uh, slideshow and then uh, start the install portal apps and VLC player. So the outcomes for this will be download portable apps, install portable apps. This will work on XP, Vista, and Windows 7, and verify the installation by installing the VLC media player on the USB drive and showing a video. Of course, your requirements are Windows operating system, XP, Vista, Win 7, USB 2.0 or higher, and a USB flash drive. To download and install portable apps, we'll go to the Portal Apps web page. This is portalapps.com. We can just click right here on Download Now. now they have a lot of uh, advertising here, so you kind of have to figure your way through the advertising. And it says your portableapps.com software will download will start in two, three seconds. Now down here at the bottom you'll see that it's uh ask you a question, do you want to run and save? Let's not go to this video converter download or any place else. We're just gonna save this. And we're gonna save it and to wherever it tells. So it's basically gonna be your user directory. And you'll see that right here it's an exe file, so we can go ahead and just run it uh, when it comes download. So now we're going to open the folder and then we're going to run this file well and click run select the language English click next and of course you've got a license agreement and you can go over that simply click I agree and browse desolation folder is going to be a USB folder go to computer or removable disk E which is USB folder and we're just simply once we're here we just simply click OK and then click install and it's fairly quick install uh, if it takes any amount of time we'll come back we'll come back later and uh, you don't have to sit here and watch this little green uh, item go across the screen. Okay, once the install has been completed, 
and it says the launch portal apps.com platform we'll go ahead and launch it click a finish and this is our portable apps.com so now we're ready to download a portable app from portable apps.com uh, go to the page get apps and with all these apps we're going to install VLC media player which is in the music and video section we'll click on VLC media player portable and download it now again we'll go back to the down pa download page and it says it'll start in a few seconds and we go down here and we'll save it and you'll notice that it says PAF which stands for the Portable Apps Foundation and it's going to take a few seconds to download the actual because we didn't have a choice to where to download it's actually download to your user file and then downloads uh, directory inside of your username file we'll come back when it's uh, fully downloaded and then make sure it's installed correctly once the download is completed uh, Open, uh, open a folder. We'll see that it, it's downloaded. But let's go check and see uh, on the computer. We're going to go start, and that's portalapps.com. So let's install it. I'll go to apps here. Install a new app. And see where it says Mike's download goes there automatically. Click here, open, and we're going to run it. And select the components to install, and we'll click next. Now, one thing I really have to mention is that frequently I have to reinstall apps in Portable Media Player. It seems like you, there's a failure rate in the install that is uh, just uh, increased, you know, which is way more than what you would normally expect. So when I make these uh, USB uh, media sticks that will run all these apps, I make sure I have one uh, USB drive that's working correctly and then copy that USB drive and to all the others so this is installing we'll come back when it's, when it's complete and then we'll run the VLC media player to verify that it's working and that it's correctly installed so now we've got the install is finished click on finish and so now we're going to have to restart uh, PAF foundation from the removable disk E or USB drive and up comes uh, a portableapps.com uh, uh, window and we've got you notice we have VLC media player portable so we're going to start that and because it's a USB drive uh, sometimes it's a little slow in starting the software So these windows pop up here, which is a privacy and network access policy. For some reason, they seem to pop up twice in a row. And click Save and Continue. Save and Continue. And then we're going to go Media and Open File. And go. I've already placed a media file onto the uh, USB drive. So we go to Computer, Movable Disk. Now, Portable Apps has a Documents folder. When Portable Apps installs, it also installs a Documents folder and music, pictures, videos. And I've already placed a file in here. This one's Storytelling Alice. Hello. My and this is a previous video from my channel.
Um, so I we notice that it, everything is working, but uh, so we're going to close this, quit, and then media, no, actually quit, and then I'm going to start the portable apps foundation uh, again, just to, so that if the install did not go correctly, you simply have to do right click here, do an uninstall, and then go ahead and reinstall it. Thank you.